The role of retiring Chief Justice Dame San Elias in many of the seminal legal developments of New Zealand has been praised at her final sitting. On International Women's Day the speakers paying tribute to Dame San were all women, not by design but because of the roles they held. Dame Shan was the first woman to hold the office of Chief Justice, and made the role her own, because she was the best person for the job, Law Society President Catherine Beck said. Her advocacy for Maori in the courts and before the Wai Itanji Tribunal was of lasting importance to the respect she built within Mauridom, she said. In Wellington on Friday, New Zealand's first female Solicitor General, Unija Goss, QC, included another distinction. You do do a good terrifying your honor, if I may say so, she said. Elias said the journey that began with the Treaty of Wai Itanji in 1840 was not yet finished. She praised the judges she had sat alongside in the Supreme Court. They all had beautiful minds even when they had sometimes been wrong-headed, she said. Elias is about to turn 70, the age at which she must retire as a judge. As well as VIPs and members of the legal profession, the crowd at the ceremony included the judge's 92-year-old mother. The judge's grandchildren were in the court too and she told them, if you get bored you can go out. Elias began Auckland Law School just before she turned 17.